in my life. The first light is the one I can see with my own eyes. And the second light is the inner light that can go unnoticed if you're not really looking real carefully. Do not cure me, the darkness said. I am not sick. Come lay your body by mine and stroke my wet head. Sing the secret song we made up, gibberish and bad words. The one that made us laugh too loud, our teeth showing. I'll call you by our shared nickname. You we soft near camp, but the case hammer. Arev Jan, in Shokov, Sidali, ye mash good near camp, ins hammer. Gasem Uriskinatsel, Gasem Tesnel, co nor the co pomegranate, co thou, co light. Gasem Diani walked the way of aerosol and empty walls. Diani parsed the darkness for motion my body gives to the can. Diani live in the flick with fingertip. In the laughter of Vartan after escaping the traffic out of John. Dear Gravity, this morning I heard the bird in burden, the song of it, and remembered something about light. The speed of it, yes, and the separating of it from darkness, from dark, from darkness, from dark, from darkness, from darkness, from darkness. When I told you to write a poem about light, like, what did you think? Immediately, like, my mind went underground. I sort of went, the only way in is, you know, it's opposite. And I was dark years ago. I was dark during the Obama years, you know? Like, I've been, I'm naturally dark. And I think that was from this idea of, like, you have to afflict the comforted. And now I don't feel like there's very many people who are comforted, and so you have to now comfort the afflicted. You had to go in the dark. Yeah, I had to go in the dark. I had to go in the dark, and I always am like a friend of like the naughty and the nasty and the hated and the like closets and dirty. Like, where is the, is the quote unquote dark stuff hiding that needs our embrace? I'm gonna like start crying. I don't want to cry. Actually, two other people cried today. <laughs> so, you know, where, like, what, what am I hiding from myself? What are we hiding from ourselves that needs, um, needs our embrace? about human beings, a clever way water devised to move itself around the planet, to defy you, pure gravity. Water using stardust as vehicles. We are watery stars that you hold close, so close we believe we were wholly yours. But this morning, a little bird reminded me that we are really creatures of light. Light, which is a million, billion, 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 billion times stronger than you, dear gravity. Even when you've pulled us down into our graves, we will escape your grasp and become the light inside of flight. midst of darkness, a light that somehow someone carries inside themselves. My mother, Micaela Morales, had that kind of light. She had figured out at an early age 
that her life was going to be a struggle. Worrying too much about it or being upset or angry all the time would serve no useful purpose. Even though I had 12 brothers and sisters, she always made me feel like I was truly a very spoiled child. She was a great conversationalist, even though she had only a third grade education and spoke little English, because she had become such a great listener. She was able to transfer that light to me during our conversations as she was preparing tortillas and dinner at the stove. And I remember always being in the kitchen, not really helping much, but trying to be first in line for dinner and get a chance to nibble before everyone else was served. You know, when you started this poem, you were crying. Why? I just brought back a lot of memories of my mother. She's been gone 30 years now, which is, you know, as a 64-year-old is a long time. And, uh, you know, I just, I miss her more today than any of the other days, you know. We are all light in this world we live. Different arrangements and colors like Roy G. Biv. We all can shine. Let us view life in that pretense. All of us with our own diverse wavelengths, whether it is radio, gamma, micro, or X. We come in many different contexts, all shining with different types of interactions. Sometimes light bends us like refractions. The amount of light shown depends on the actions or the kaleidoscopes of our emotions that show our compassion. We hope that our lights will provide common semantics and demonstrate real life quantum mechanics. Cause there are two sides to every story, but shine places both in one category. How do we glow? Better yet, how do we illuminate? I say love is at the center of how we jubilate. So much hate in the world has become so intense and love is the only thing to help us get back to our inner radiance. The twists and turns of life can make one shimmer. Time is guaranteed to no one. So these are the times of glimmer, a simple flash, as we go along our way. Might be the bright spot in someone's day. And if we work to help one another, it gives us all a gleam. of how lucky fireflies are to be of little economic importance. My name is Pockets and Drawers. Call me Closets and Diaries. It wasn't a flashlight in your face, man. It was subtle. Subdued. Let's play hide and seek. You are it. Go! You asked a bit timidly if you could call me Candle. I look at you, my novel. I look so party in letting us. I do have many flair and boogle men. You said. You'd always been scared of the dark.
We are watery stars. We are watery stars that you hold close. We are watery stars that you hold close. So close, we believe we were hearing yours. We are watery stars that you hold close. So close, we believe we were holding yours. But this morning, a little bird reminded me. We are watery stars that you hold close. So close, we believe we were holding yours. But this morning, a little bird reminded me that we are really creatures of light. Come to me blind, I answered. We are part and parcel. Suddenly, all the stories I had read about the light of the moon now made sense. Do you understand this? If you want to see me, don't make yourself an eye. Lose your sight. Make your body a candle. Do you understand this? Out of John, what is tall in the blaze? What is singing to bricks and cinder blocks? What is fixed compressions in the can? Dying spin our imagination, then rhyme it on the wall. Dying release through paint scent and blunts. Dying transform the body in public into curve and kinetic. Dying looming into gathering at the wall. Even when you've pulled us down into our graves, we will escape your grasp and become a light inside of form. That is the true basis of our American dream. So, twinkle, twinkle, little star, shine your light so the world can know who you are. To me, we all are stars and we all are light. And it's like, how do we choose to, to have our light shine, to live? and to live in the basis, for me, under the basis of love and let that love shine, because that's the only thing that's going to really, like I said, take out all this hate and blase, blase that's going on right now. So, twinkle, twinkle, little star. Like, get back. Like, be that light who you are. So, yeah, that's, that's the tie-in, man. Right?